The Ag Minute on This Week in Louisiana Agriculture is brought to you by your Louisiana propane dealers. Fuel for our future. Since the month of June is National Dairy Month, we want to highlight a few of the hardworking dairy farmers in Louisiana. This week we'll kick off with Duncan Acres Dairy Farm in Hackley, Louisiana. Twilas Taylor Fry shows us how dairy farming is deep-rooted in the heart of the Duncan family. Down this dirt road is where Brent and Lori Duncan make their living as organic dairy farmers. It it's, takes a lot of devotion, a lot of dedication, a lot of a lot of discipline to be a dairy farmer, you know, you have to work seven days a week. Founded in 1949 by Brent's father, Ray Duncan, dairy farming runs deep in this family's blood. Him and my mom both worked really hard to, you know, they had, had to raise three kids and, and, and back in those days it was, it was pretty tough. You know? With Lori's love for animals and Brent's determination, Duncan Acres is a thriving Louisiana dairy farm. And the Lord has helped us tremendously, you know, and given us the wisdom and knowledge and understanding of what to do and how to do it. And with that faith comes a whole lot of grit. Lori's job on the farm is raising these baby calves, and Brent's is to help make the baby calves through artificial insemination. I would say this separates um, this this separates the good cows and the, and the mediocre cows. While breeding to the right bulls is an important task, he says it's only a sliver of what makes this farm a success. And see how she really spikes. Technology is key to running this farm. Clicking away, Duncan can check everything there is to know about his cows. Before we were so busy, with, you know. Oh, labor, 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 you know, where this computer and the and all the all the electronic stuff has helped. The data is picked up by sensors on the cow's neck that can tell Duncan when to breed, how to feed, and even how much milk every cow produces. There's a lot of good tools out there in this world. It's just a matter of being able to, you know, Put them in your operation and utilize them to the best of their ability and that's what we've done with this. Another edge the Duncans hold is this piece of machinery. Two years ago they installed this rotary milking parlor, the only one in Louisiana. My husband uh, decided to step outside the box and go out from conventional to organics. It was new, um, it was innovative. Lori says switching from conventional to organic nine years ago put them in a different kind of market. We made our own contract and we were set we set our milk at a certain price and we are paid the same amount every month. A far cry from how Brent grew up. It was a hard and long struggle, but um, it has really helped help us become better dairy farmers. And as far as how he's doing with taking over his father's farm, I'll let Miss Nita Duncan do the talking. Excellent. I think he's come a long, long way, <laughs> but he's worked hard at it, and he had some good help too. A long way indeed, and the Duncans continue on the road of success. This is what I want to do, and what I, you know, I think it's my destiny to do this. So. Right now, the Duncans plan to expand their farm even more in the next year, adding another loafing barn for the cows. And such a beautiful farm and such beautiful people. Moving on to this week's Ag Minute.